So here we are on Mafia Island, just heading into camp, and we're going to meet up with Simon, one of our senior volunteers, to uh, give us a quick tour. How are you doing this fine day, Simon? Good, thanks. Mambo, everyone. Caribou, and welcome to Mafia Island's Frontier Camp. This is our main camp. This is where all the volunteers work, rest, and play, with a whole host of tents, camps, and buildings to facilitate everything. This is Rosie, our cook. Say hello. Hi. She's a bit feisty in the morning, so watch out for her. This is where we cook everything, and in here is the kitchen where everything's prepared. At the moment we have two volunteers hard at work, Fiona and Luke. Luke, what are you making? I'm making bread. Oh, sounds delicious. It's going to be our breakfast. Perfect. Fiona, what are you chopping? I am chopping an onion. Wow. <laughs> so this is our communal bander, where after a hard day's work, the volunteers like to come, blow up some steam, <laughs> relax with each other, and just play, play a bit of cards, <laughs> read some books. That sort of thing. These are our two staff members, hard at work as always. What are you working on, Tom? Environmental Education Day for the kids. Sounds fascinating. Whatever. Good luck with that one. Thank How you. about you, Luce? I'm looking at the effects of some destructive physics. <laughs> You're on Facebook. <laughs> wow, I can't wait to hear all about that. Amazing. Now, wandering up the hill, we come up to our dive set. This is where we store all our dive equipment. We've <laughs> a couple of drying racks either side to make sure our equipment is lovely and dry to wear the next day. If you're looking inside the dive shed, we notice it's nice and full, plenty of stuff for people to use. Now, I'm sure your eyes have been taken by three, these three young hunks over here. Right behind me is our gymnasium. Hi lads, how's it going? Uh, yeah, good. Yeah. 1001. <laughs> how, yeah. how many reps is everyone on? Uh, two and a half. Two and a half. Do you want good? How many pull-ups is that? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of, it's a couple of days. It's a couple of days. Well, keep up the good work. As you can see, we like to play hard, but also work hard. <laughs> this is one of the two communal banders for volunteers on site. As you can see, it's lovely, clean, spacious and airy, and everyone sleeps either side in lovely mosquito nets on uh, <laughs> bedrolls. It doesn't look much, but it becomes a home from home once you get used to it. So when you've had a hard day working, or an even harder night partying, the hammock is the place to be to sleep off that hangover, or just recharge your batteries. And behind us you'll notice a couple more of the luxurious staff <laughs> banders. So, these are our two camp long drops, the toilets. They're rather infamous amongst people here, and they have a bit of a reputation of being basic. But once you've been here for a few weeks, you soon get used to them. There's um, not many modern luxuries, but they're basic and they do the job, which is all you ever need from a toilet. So, back down the hill, we come to the next communal bander and the other shower. And I find it's best to come armed when you're this far down the camp. So, over here we have one of our lovely volunteers showering. Luke, how's the shower going? It's uh, going quite well at the moment. Brilliant. Would you like a hand? Um, I guess. <laughs> So, perfect. That's the only way to get clean in Tanzania. It's our communal banda where people who are not in the top banda sleep. This one's slightly larger, more spacious, but a lovely place to sleep. Nice and cosy, with lots of little friends around for company. So, I hope you've enjoyed your tour of the Frontier Tanzanian Marine Camp. These are all our happy volunteers who've all had an amazing time here. So from everyone here, goodbye! <laughs>